We are here today to talk about a great event in history. A profound event that affected the course of an entire na- <laughs> Really? Oh, this is so emancipating. Yes, we are here today to talk about a great event in history. A profound event that altered the course of Southwest Arizona, here in the middle of the desert, perched along the banks of the Colorado River. Two score and 12 years ago, as Mr. Lincoln might say, in 1961, 6,000 people signed a petition, 2,500 on the first day alone, requesting an election to see if this area was ready for a junior college. And was it ever? When all the ballots had been counted, 95% of the voters had approved the first Arizona college in 40 years. And so here we are, 50 years later. Arizona Western College has grown from about 1,000 students that first year to 10,000 today. As we prepare to celebrate five decades of history, we pause to pay tribute to the leaders who had the vision, to the faculty and staff who came before us, and to all of you, the ones carrying the torch today, making a difference in the lives of our students. You know, people used to talk about and complain about how it, it was so, the college was so far out, and it seemed like it in those days. But actually, now, where Arizona Western College is really starting to become more the center of the community. I worked in the fields, I worked in construction, and I saw an awful lot of people that uh, basically that was going to be their life. And Arizona Western College afforded me the opportunity to visualize what education could do for these individuals. And I lived through that and had an opportunity to come back to college. And um, I think Arizona Western College has just made a significant difference in so many other people's lives. So I don't think I would have been in the profession that I am right now. I think AWC molded me and instilled in me that I needed not just to stop there, but to continue my education. I attribute Arizona Western and baseball to uh, furthering my uh, opportunities for education. And it's like I said, it's always a, a very uh, fond memory I have. This is where you go to um, get a better job. And this is where you go to make friends. And this is where you go to um, seek opportunities for activities and for performing arts. And so I think that that's where we're heading. And I think that it's a great place for us to go. You know, the people make the, make the college, so I felt very positive about it. And as we uh, went around the community, the, the community had bought into the college, and, and that's extremely important, you know. There's no stopping you. You want to continue to grow and grow and grow. Here it is, AWC. Like I say, <laughs> there's no excuse. If you want to improve your life, if you want to grow, become more intellectual, you never stop growing. You, the people of Yuma particularly, deserve the highest praise for your vision, for your persistence, and for your cooperative efforts to bring about the establishment here of the first institution under our new State Junior College program. You have taken the lead, and I doubly commend you.